If you are an unionized employee working for the Fraser Health Authority, then the information in this video will be valuable to you. I was a disabled worker and was fired by my local health authority. I worked as a nurse in BC until permanent disability ended my career, and I was awarded long-term disability benefits by an arbitration board referred to as a Claims Review Committee. According to the Labor Relations Board, Claims Review Committee awards are final and binding on all parties and cannot be challenged by anyone. However, following the award, my benefits were wrongly terminated by my plan administrator. My employer claimed that placing me back to work would violate my collective agreement and fired me for being disabled. I went to the BC Supreme Court seeking fairness and justice. The judge told me the Labour Relations Board has emasculated the courts and judges are fearful of losing their jobs. He also said that he could not rule on my case. The only thing he was allowed to say was that there was no fraud in my petition. I experienced long-term disability fraud and corruption inside my workplace. I have detailed my experience for you at the Nye Disability. Go there now and read the story of my disability workplace experience as was told to the BC Supreme Court. I hope you found this Deny Disability Worker News video helpful. Please support me by spreading the truth about the disempowering reality unionized employees will likely have to contend with when disabled in BC. Watch and like my videos, leave a comment, and tell your friends and loved ones about my disability experience in BC. Share my story on your social networks, and if possible, please support me with a donation. My story could become your experience, or the experience of someone you love. Help BC workers understand just how disabling unionized workplace authority can be. Bless you for your kindness and desire to live a life of awareness and accountability.